there's always something going on at the if you have an aqua If you have an aquarium store, there's always something going on. In this case, one of my skimmers, the pump stopped working. I had this skimmer running since, I believe 2011. Reef Octopus RS5000. Really good protein skimmer. Really good pump also. This, what happened was these snails that went through the overflow box, see right here? They went inside through this uh, opening and uh, the pump kept working, you know. Pump kept working, some of these uh, pins they broke, but nothing was, uh, nothing will stop this pump, it's really amazing. It grinded a little bit inside, but after many, many years, it's still going. So I was fixing it a little bit something like this happens to you if there's like a coralline algae growing different organs you can put it in um, uh, vinegar but so I was like okay let me just talk a little bit about protein skimmers and pumps protein skimmers are very important they remove a, a lot of organic waste from the Soviet organic waste from the water and this one in particular there's several uh, designs but this one has the pinwheel right here and the pinwheel breaks the bubbles in tiny, tiny bubbles. The skimmer, I have it running on the boat tank. Actually, the boat tank has been running without the skimmer for a while. Let me show you how a skimmer works. I got, I have this one right here. So you see all these, this one is a high door protein skimmer. Really good skimmer also. I have this one for a few years already. Nice organic way. So all these was dissolved in the water it's truly amazing so these bubbles the more turbulence the more the bubbles are circulating the finer the bubbles all that helps be and makes the skimmer more efficient or less efficient so they suck the air this one sucks the air from here goes here and then the pump mixes it um, uh, they are adjustable you can adjust the water level inside right here you can adjust the amount of air that goes in but and then the collection cup you want to clean it so you just take this out and you clean it let me see if the refugium light is still on so you guys can see so that's the this is the boat tank right there and there's a ton of coral growing everywhere You barely can see it's a boat, but it is a boat. So right here under this pink light, I got this uh, very strong light for macroalgae growth. I want all the algae to grow right here, but the thing is the light is so strong, it makes algae grow everywhere, which is okay. So that's a skimmer, it's off, it's been off for a while. Well, there's no light over here because the light already went off but you see this one how it's working actually the collection cup needs to be cleaned and changed but super super old it's still going right there amazing really good protein skimmers so today I'll be trying to work between customers to work around this uh, actually there's another skimmer here that I can talk about so it's a little better model this is the uh, actually this is newer so this is a newer skimmer these ones are made by reef octopus are really good skimmers very uh, sturdy and strong and they do less except they used to have this pump before that was the good pump now that more let me show you oh. I do have this uh, massive skimmer that I'm going to set up for a different project that I'm working. I'll keep you guys posted when the time comes. <laughs> but here, I don't even know. It's it's real big. Actually, 
It's not as big as that one. That's an RK2 skimmer. That thing is tall. That's really big. That's commercial. That's three, four, five thousand gallon tanks. But this one's small, lure, but still, for the regular hobbies, this thing is uh, pretty big. So you got it's just four pumps. The air goes right here, and it mixes. It was it's on this stand, so it's high enough. You can drain it. It's got a few extra things that other skimmers don't. But this pump is definitely not as good as as that other one that I'm working on. So these ones. I had problems before and I'm crossing my fingers the coral view will keep this one in stock or I could swap this one for those ones really like those ones truly amazing pumps worth worth every penny look it's got a long power cord which it's always handy so <laughs> so luckily I still had some of the old pumps in uh, it's in, in still in stock. I don't know. Art. I haven't used Reef Octopus later. I've been using a lot of eShops. So this is the S2000, S200. Really nice little skimmer. Now to use these gate valves to adjust. So it, it allows to more, more like a precision adjustment than the then the pipe which is still fine the pipe you know it's not a big deal at all the other thing is space savers i like the space saver so the pump is inside this pump really really good pump sieges they do last they last i had these pumps for eight years i got actually one running over there on the anemone tank right there with the clowns so that one's been running since magna that happened in florida the magnet that happened in Florida, which this tank was actually there as a show tank, as we were actually selling from this tank, corals and a bunch of stuff. So somebody bought this tank, then I bought it again. But, um, you know, this is really cool. It's got a bunch of little different features. So if this gets full of water, it's got a little draining cap. You know, I also like to have a long hose connected here to the drain, so we can drain it also this plate right here allows the bubbles to stay more up on this area so if they if the bubbles come down here they will start coming out and you have micro bubbles in your tank so this pressure uh, chamber pressure plate it's it allows for the bubbles to stay above also you see the little angle right there this will make the bubbles spin around so it will increase the contact of the bubble. See a nice hose, a lot of air can go in the little hole. Actually this diameter here and the pump over there, the CJ, the triangle. Now that I'm a bit more sensitive about freaking snails going inside, so this will allow you to only really tiny snails can go in. And this one is also a pinwheel, which works very well. So snails, if you have something like a Red Sea with a nice strainer right there and a cover on top, you won't have a problem. So that's this is an example. There's many, many skimmers. It's always better to have a skimmer than not having. Uh, this is another option, but you see the design is a little bit older. It doesn't have the, the baffles to deflect the flow. But still an amazing skimmer, really good pumps and sieges. Um, they're easy to get the replacement for the sieges. Uh, what else can I say? So the skimmers, they remove a lot of organic waste from the water. If you don't have a skimmer, you can bypass that by doing water changes and also using activated carbon. I like to use activated carbon with the skimmers also, so allows me to feed a little bit more and keep the water cleaner. So that's the video for today all right guys that's an achilles thing
5,000. That's probably, that sounds better actually. The bubble blaster, yeah, right? The bomb, the bomb is totally in stock. You can get it, it ordered at any moment. Got, uh, let's, let's see the skimmer. I was, uh, I set up the skimmer yesterday, the new pump. Let's see how it's running. All right. That's a, that's a sample with this massive LED panel. Love it. That's to grow macroalgae. It's growing everything. There's algae growing everywhere in the sump and not on top, which is amazing. Love it. Look at that. Nice foam right there. Love it. Brand new pump. Jesus Christ. Can't see anything. But the thing is, that's what I want. I want to have all the algae growing here, none on top. Doesn't look too pretty, but I don't mind. And I want all the copepods and all the little different organisms growing there. So it feeds the corals as they are trying to uh, reproduce, giving eggs, larvae, post larvae. I want to have sponges growing, I want everything to grow here. So this is another tank, but uh, with a lot, a lot of different organisms. I like biodiversity. Uh, the little my marine biologist mindset likes um, all the weird stuff. That might not be pretty for most people, but for us, it's just lovely.